There are actually two kinds of band saws, saws made for cutting metal and saws made for cutting wood. Here we'll be talking about a wood saw. A band saw consists of a motor, two wheels, a table, and a continuous loop of flexible saw blade. The blade's adjusted by turning a tracking wheel, which assures that the blade won't pop off the wheel. Band saws are extremely versatile and handy to use in the knife shop. You can cut handle scales from larger blocks of wood, you can profile the scales, you can cut plastic, wood, and if you don't tell the bandsaw police, you can even cut materials like aluminum. In theory, broader blades are for resawing and other straight cutting applications, while smaller, finer toothed blades are for cutting tighter curves. Since the skinny blades can cut straight, but the fat blades can't cut curvy, I use skinny blades. This saw is a 14 inch saw, meaning that the wheels are 14 inches in diameter. The bigger the wheels, the deeper the throat, and the bigger the work you can cut with it. You can get nifty little tabletop machines that cost a lot less than this one, and will probably be sufficient to do 90% of the things that you'd want to do with a band saw. But then there's that other 10%. Which brings me to the biggest disadvantage of band saws. You can't chop long stuff, at least not width-wise. I love mine and I use it more than any saw I own, but there are just some things that you need other saws for. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to my channel and then check out my website, waltersoilblades.com, where you'll find the most comprehensive and the complete version of all these cool videos that I've posted here on YouTube.